Piercings can take a minimum of three months to heal and can go up to six to 12 months. This is a helix piercing, so we recommend six to 12 months to fully heal. We recommend saline spray or the saline wipes to clean your piercing. If you're gonna be using the spray, you want to use a piece of non-woven gauze and you want to spray the gauze really well. And then you can just fold it and hold it around the piercing, front and back, and hold it gently for five minutes. Once you've done that, any buildup you have will be nice and soft. And then with the corner of the gauze here, you can go around the front and the back of the piercing to remove any of the buildup. If you're gonna be using the wipes, it's pretty much the same thing. So you want to take the wipe out. These wipes can be pretty wet, so you can always um, kind of squeeze some out or even squeeze some on the piercing to give it a good soak. And then you want to do exactly the same and just fold it for five minutes, hold it, give it a really good soak. And then again with the corner, go around so you're wiping underneath the front and the back of the piercing. Once you've removed any buildup, it's really important that you dry the piercing down. Moisture is gonna help bacteria grow. So again, with a piece of dry non-woven gauze, you wanna go around and dry the piercing down. Other than cleaning, it's very important that you don't sleep on the piercing. Usually I recommend about one to two months for that. Um, obviously it's gonna aggravate the piercing and it's gonna cause more swelling, which will stop the piercing from healing. You don't wanna touch the piercing with hands at all. So this is why we always use either the non-woven gauze or the wipe to actually touch the piercing with. Whenever you're gonna be cleaning the piercing, you wanna make sure that you've washed your hands really well. You don't wanna to touch, twist or turn the piercing at any point, especially because your piercing is an open wound. You have so much bacteria on your hands, so no touching. You don't wanna accidentally pull in any of the buildup into the piercing. When you're in the shower, you can also use the shower to clean your piercing. So you can just hold your ear under the shower and let the warm water rinse the piercing. This is a really good way of loosening any kind of buildup that you have around the area. After four to six weeks, we recommend that you come in for a checkup. We make sure the piercing is healing nicely and it's also very important that we downsize the piercing. As you can see, to start with, the jewelry is longer on the back for swelling. When the swelling has gone, this jewelry is then too long. If you leave this in, this is going to move around and become an irritant. So when you come back, we change the back piece of jewelry to a shorter piece and this helps with the healing.